How's it going everybody? Good evening. Um, just want to do a video while I got my bag out and all my clothes out. Just want to go ahead and do a, a, review, a review for you guys um, for up season, uh, upcoming uh, deer season. So what I got here is the Scentlock 8K chamber bag. Um, this one I did get with the with the Oz 500 for inside so you can um, help reduce and get rid of those unwanted odor, odors that are on your uh, hunting clothes. Um, so I'm just going to walk through it, show you how much clothes I can fit inside of it, talk about every piece of clothing I got, and uh, yeah, just go ahead and get started once I get this tube back in here. Um, what, babe? I'm ready. Not yet. Hold on. We'll do your movie next, I promise. Um, so we're going to start out with the Oz 500. The Oz 500 does come with this. Um, if you select it so all you have to do is you lift up this pouch the Oz 500 goes inside and you make sure your hose stays stays attached just for me taking it off and on so much um, just make sure your hose is attached close it up then down here, there's another hose. That hose, you just attach it. Then you plug on the back side of this, of this bag on the outside, there's a, um, there's a hole in the zipper so you can run your plug through it. It comes with a car charger and it comes with a, a wall charger. So you can do it on the go or you can do it before you leave while you're at hunt camp. Um, if you want to run, I'm just gonna take it out just to just so I can open it up more. So uh, first off, I'm gonna start with my Revenant, my Setlock Revenant. Um, this is my late season gear. Extremely warm. Um, I have worn this on 40 degree days. I have worn this on 30 degree days, and they were windy. Um, 40 miles per hour, 20 miles per hour, late season, your go-to weather. Um, I was very warm very very warm um i didn't feel no wind come through at all um i mean it, you can sit all day sit all day in comfort all right then i got the got the pants to, to go with the revenant so i have a complete suit for late season just gonna put that in there next i'm gonna go to my base layers um right now this is just my heavyweight um I get cold easily, and it sucks, but I do. Um, I will wear this under my mid-season if it's too, <laughs> it's kind of weird to say, if it's too warm, or if it's a little bit too warm for my Revenant, but it's perfect for my mid-season, and I just want to keep that little chill off me, um, I will throw my heavyweight base layers underneath my mid-season, and it's, it's perfect. It works out nice. I'm warm. Um, like I said, you can sit all day, not get discomfortable. Perfect. So next up, I got my Scentlock Tactics. Uh, this is my mid-season. This is my rut gear. Um, sometimes when that rut kicks in, sometimes it's cold, sometimes it's warm. Um, I will wear this. I've worn this on... 60 degree days i've worn this down to about 40 degrees um and i sat all day during my rut kept me nice and warm this is a jacket to it same thing nice warm jacket very silent there's no there's nothing to it um sometimes you get those you get some of those camo uh, outfits and you can you can hear it um every time you move you or if you're against the tree bark you know you can hear it move this nothing it's very everything is silent um i fold this up a little better like i said so, i mean i can fit my entire arsenal in here um from a whole season just gonna put them in there next up is my favorite my favorite for early season for early season deer my favorite for turkey season um going to check troll cameras in the summertime this is my Savannah Crosshair. Uh, this one's in Real Tree. 
uh, real tree edge. Um, I've worn this on 80 plus degree days in here in Maryland on opening days. I felt comfortable. Um, I didn't. I didn't sweat. I mean, I, I sweat walking a little bit, but I cooled off immediately, and I, I, <laughs> I was able to hunt all day. I've actually sat all day in early season with this 80 plus degree days all the way down to about 60 degree days I've worn this. Um, it gets below 60 I'll throw a light, a light uh, base layer underneath it. So that was the pants. That's the jacket, same thing. Um, Savannah crosshair. I think inside I normally keep I normally keep my face mask inside so I never forget it. So I'll, I'll, I'll go through that one next, actually. And the crosshair, it's, I mean, it's so light and it's so, I mean, it's so compact. You can, if it's really hot, you can actually walk walk to your stand. You can throw this inside your backpack. If you don't want to sweat it out um, while you're sitting up there, you can, I mean, fold this thing up. I mean, it's, put it right inside your backpack. Once you get to your stand, just throw it on. Get up there, sit down, chill out, cool off. And this is the, this is the, uh, the hat that I got, the lightweight early season hat. Um, I like it because it has a brim on it, and it's a full full head uh, face mask. Um, so you know, it starts to, like drizzle a little bit, or you get that sun. Uh, I'm a big bow hunter. That's mainly all I do. Um, you get that sun coming in, hitting you right. You can, you know, tilt your hat down, tilt your brim down, block it out, turn a little bit, whatever you gotta do to get that shot off. So I just throw that right on top. So I don't know if you guys can see, I got, I got room. There's still room in here. I mean, if I really wanted to, I can fit, I can get two more early season gears. I can get another mid season. I mean, there's room in this thing to go around. So what I do with that room, I just throw my safety harness in there. And sometimes I'll throw my accessories in there. Like I'll take my, take my knife set. I'll just throw it in there. This way, I'll never forget it. It's always with me. It's always at the truck. Um, and that's it. And then you just zip her up. It's nice. It comes with a shoulder strap. Shoulder straps are very easy. It goes on top. Just clip it in. And you're ready to rock and roll. The cool thing is, you got these real big side pouches also. So this is where I throw, I put my orange at. Just more accessories like a deer drag, another orange hat, grunt call. Just throw all that inside there. You can put, yeah, I mean, you can put extra clothes in there if you want to. I mean, extra shirts. You can put socks. Pretty sure on this side, got a pair of socks or something over here. Let's see what we got. Hand warmers. Told y'all I get cold easily. They don't go nowhere without me. And I don't go nowhere without them. How about that? Um, like I said, it's got two big side pouches. You can throw your socks, you can throw extra shirts in there, you know, any little thing you need. Um, keep it dry for the day. If you have a long walk, yeah, go back to the go back to the vehicle to change. You can do all that and keep it all inside here. This way it always goes with you. But um Yeah, so that's my that's my review on the bag. That's my Oz 500. I use this around the house. Um, you know, I get some, you get some odors that you just want to knock out. I just take the, uh, outlet adapter for your, you know, for the plug, plug into a room, unoccupied room, turn it on 30 minutes, shut the door and I, or I'll leave the house and, um, come back and it smells fresh. The motors are gone. So that's everything right there, folks. Y'all have a good night. Have a good rest of your weekend. Can't wait for that uh, season to open back up September. How about that, y'all? Alrighty, good night.